Okay, so we have our alarm set for three hours. Um, it says to raise and stir occasionally, so I'll have to be sure that I go ahead and clean my brazier. And then, meanwhile, it says that we can, the onions take about 10 minutes. And the mushrooms So I think we're going to go ahead and get started on the pearl onions and then we'll go from there um, because I feel like if they get cold it's really not going to make that much of a difference. So what it says specifically is place the pearl onions in a heat proof bowl, fill the bowl, fill a bowl with ice water and cover the onions with boiling water and let it soak for 10 minutes. So I'm going to go ahead and get some water on the stove and see if I can get that up to boil. So I think what we'll use for our heat proof bowl, it's going to be this bowl right here. And then for the bowl with ice, I think I'm going to use the bowl that I just put in the sink. So I'll have to clean that at some point. Um, and hopefully I can get that uh, covered. Um, so first off, I gotta find a big pan to add some boiling water. I have one from earlier. I'm just gonna fill it and then see if I can get it up to a boil and go from there. but I feel like a gas stove just like heats up so much quicker. Um, I had a gas stove, or I've never had a gas stove until we moved in here. And I always had like, you know, one of the flat tops. And when I moved in here, I would like put some butter in the pan and like wait for it to like start, you know, getting to the point, kind of just going through the routine I previously had at my old apartment. And I would always like turn around the normal amount of time and then I'd look back and my, okay. And my, um, my butter would be like burning or something. So, and then I said, I, I see that somebody said hello. So hello, um, happy you guys are joining me. This is my first stream. So I'm really happy that somebody's watching. I felt like it was a really good way just if I was on Twitch to um, kind of help me with my habit because I really enjoy cooking, but I feel like cooking was kind of turning into kind of a chore for me, if that makes sense. Like every single time uh, I was cooking, I had never had any forefront, um, any ideas what I was gonna cook. I would just kind of like peek in my refrigerator and say, hey, what do I have in here? Oh, it looks like I got a follow. Uh, thank you for following me, uh, Helmet Humper. Love your name, super, <laughs> super fun. Uh, looks like my dogs are in there playing. Uh, they're very vocal, so that's one of the pros. <laughs> Sorry, my dogs are in there fighting. Um, 
Just waiting for the water to boil. I'm definitely, I feel like I haven't eaten anything today, so, um, which I haven't. I had like a half a bowl of ice cream and that's all that's in my tummy right now. So I feel like I'm like definitely feeling the effects of my blueberry martini. Um, so sorry about that. Um, just waiting for the water to boil and from there we can like kind of move forward. I guess I could put some ice water in that bowl because um, that is one of the steps. So I think I'm going to go ahead and wash this bowl real quick. Um, our house is over 100 years old. So I feel like I have one of the worst set up houses as far as a kitchen goes, just especially for streaming, um, just because when it comes to the setup, like there's they kind of just stuck the refrigerator wherever they wanted in the stove. There's no countertop around it. And I feel like in modern kitchens, we like have built in spaces for that. But as you guys will see in the stream, I have no built in space whatsoever for anything. So my refrigerator is just like casually sitting over here and my stove is just like casually sitting over there. Oh, well, I appreciate that. Yeah, I really do enjoy cooking. Um, when it comes to the two cam setup, I do think like I have a lot of love for like anybody who has more than just one cam or anybody who puts in the effort to go through that just because it was a lot of work to get it set up. Uh, I, I mean, I had no clue how much work it would be before I started uh, streaming. I thought it was like kind of simple and click. And then it's kind of cool because I feel like I'm learning new skills. I would have never thought that it would be so much work to have such a basic 